Nick Callow, Casey Thunder. Jalen, the, the defense again this afternoon, um, just really stifling. What's happening on that end of the floor uh, in terms of you all being connected and in, in, in your spots? I think exactly that. Um, I think we are a connected team right now. Um, we're not having a lot of like mental lapses. Um, I think the biggest thing for us was, you know, obviously being new to the playoffs as a team was just, you know, trying to eliminate a lot of the fixable mistakes that we have. So, um, you know, kind of control the controllables, be in the right spot, kind of do what our game plan is and just stick with that and, you know, just compete as hard as we can. And, you know, whatever happens after that, you know, we can adjust, but a lot of the stuff that we want to do and get accomplished, you know, you don't want to ever shoot yourself in the foot. And I think we're doing a good job of that. You guys have really, one of your top things all year has just been adaptability, uh, being able to absorb circumstances. You go out in the first quarter, and not only do you come back and, and are right in rhythm as soon as you come back after missing almost the first quarter, but Kaysen steps in, rookie, and, and he's able to just hold down the fort there. What did you make of that whole dynamic um, and the fact that you guys are able to do that type of thing? Um, well, yeah, Kaysen is special. Um, you know, everybody's kind of seen it now because we're on the, the national scene, but um, that's something that we've known since training camp and since we got him here in the organization. So that's not really a shock to me or anybody in the team, but... It just kind of shows our mentality, you know, next man up. I have supreme confidence whoever, you know, Mark puts in while I'm not, you know, while I was hurt. Would do the right thing and make the right plays. Uh, Queso stepped up big and he was good all night. You know, you have other guys coming off the bench that, that play well, Wiggs. Um, you know, everybody's just kind of ready to play and be the next man up. So that doesn't shock me. But, you know, it's kind of just been our mentality all year. All year long, you guys have also leaned on, you know, the zero and zero mindset. How much was that tested after the success at home? And then what did you see kind of getting through that in game three? Um, I think our biggest thing for us as a team is that, you know, everybody's kind of with you when you're up, and that's kind of the biggest thing. You know, when when you have success, it's it's easy to kind of take your foot off the gas and and not really pay attention to those details that I stated earlier. So I think that zero and zero mindset is something that we kind of lean on. You know, the last two games, even this game now, doesn't matter. And, so we're just kind of trying to take that approach. And, you know, every time we play, it's a totally new game, you know, a totally new team that we're playing. And 